Hi Cancer, I'm Jennifer Angel. These are your stars. Okay, so there's quite a bit of activity happening in your sun 11th house this week. So this tells me that the people that you're connecting with at the moment can play a huge part in your life. So it's almost like you can meet people that you have like a, the feeling of, wow, there's, a, you know, deja vu happening there or or you had that connection and met somebody just when the time was right. So you can be in like right place at the right time um, with this. And don't forget, Cancer, that, you know, people come into your life for all sorts of different reasons. Some people, as we know, you meet and you stay um, and they're with you right through your life. And other people, you just, you know that there's a soul connection. And if you believe in reincarnation, then you have, you know, you know that you've spent many and many lives together and you will in the future as well. And you're just uh, closely connected. Um, other people just come through because they're there just to help you get through a period in life, okay? So, uh, and sometimes you will part company with people simply because the reason that you've um, been together no longer exists and you're both individuals and you're just going off in your own journey, okay? It doesn't make it sort of right or wrong. It just means that it's time to part company for whatever reason, okay? And when that happens, you want to just let those people go freely and wish them luck and love on their journey of life and as you get on with yours and you're very good emotionally cutting off like that um cancer so uh, you know you're one of the signs that can uh, you know leave the past cut off and sort of go forward now there are some oppositions to do with let's see the Mars in this position of your chart and um, Mercury uh, the communication planet with Saturn now Saturn is in your solar fifth house this is a very social area it also can um, take in relationships and love affairs can actually start at, at this time too but you want to feel that it's right so there's a whole lot of seriousness that always happens around Saturn and let's not forget that Saturn is retrograde at the moment as well so and the one thing that Saturn it does help you to do help or hinder I mean it, it can put you back in touch with what's happening in the past um, the, and this is good it's helping it can also cause you to just linger and dwell on the past a little bit too much as well and you get into the Saturnian blues okay so that's what you don't want to do and with you cancer as I said you're pretty good at sort of moving moving on um, like that so at the early in the week let's shift focus to business at the early in the week before uh, Mercury the communication planet transits into your 11th house it's sitting there in your business sector so you can certainly um, if you're waiting for news then certainly in the early in the week or if you need to communicate with someone about a specific um, issue or opportunity then I would do that um, this week it's going to transit out of that area of your chart on the second which is Thursday okay but the vibration will still be still be there okay so lots lots happening lots good happening you've got about a couple of months now to get yourself sort of organized and then um, you're going to be in incredibly busy so use this time to get your affairs in order thanks for watching cancer I'm Jennifer Angel bye for now